the uh, Minnesota Shrike abducted and murdered eight girls over an eight-month period. Each of them had the same hair color, same eye color, same age, same height, same weight as his daughter, Abigail. There was a ninth victim who also fit Abigail Hobbs' profile, but Garrett Jacob Hobbs didn't murder her. The killer who did wanted us to know he wasn't the Minnesota Shrike. He is better than that. intelligent psychopath. He is a sadist. He will never kill like this again. So how do we catch him? Giving a lecture on Hobbes' copycat. Well, we need every good mind we can get on this. This copycat is an avid reader of Freddie Lowndes and Tattlecrime.com. He had intimate knowledge of Garrett Jacob Hobbes' murders, motives, patterns, enough to recreate them, and arguably, elevate them to art. How intimately did he know Garrett Jacob Hobbs? Did he appreciate him from afar, or did he engage him? Did he ingratiate himself into Hobbs' life? Did Hobbs know his copycat as he was known? Before Garrett Jacob Hobbs murdered his wife and attempted to do the same to his daughter, he received an untraceable call. I believe the as yet unidentified caller was our copycat killer.